What could be the grand plans of Nelson Chamisa for Zimbabwe? Today, we'll unravel the proposed policies and strategies of this opposition leader who has been striving to ascend to the presidential seat. Nelson Chamisa, a name that has been echoed across Zimbabwe's political landscape, has been challenging the incumbent president Menangagwa in a bid to reshape the country's future. Despite the skepticism and the numerous hurdles in his path, Shamisa's commitment to his vision remains unshaken. But what exactly does this vision entail? Shamisa's campaign revolves around several key promises, one of which is job creation. With high unemployment plaguing the nation, this promise is a ray of hope for the youth who form a significant portion of the population. His appeal to the Christian community and efforts in rural areas also show his intent to connect with diverse groups within the country. A significant part of Chamisa's focus falls on the country's energy crisis. Zimbabwe's businesses are struggling with severe electricity outages, leading to operational challenges and financial losses. Chamisa aims to significantly increase electricity generation, a move that could potentially propel the economy forward and bring relief to suffering industries like mining. The economy, indeed, is a central concern for voters. Zimbabwe is grappling with hyperinflation, currency devaluation, and the impacts of the COVID-19 pandemic. Amidst these challenges, Shamisa's proposed policies highlight his intent to bring about economic stability and growth. However, Chamisa's journey is not without its challenges. His campaign faces restrictions, intimidation, and a lack of funding. The ruling party's control over state machinery and resources presents a formidable obstacle. Yet, the outcome of the election remains uncertain, with polls showing divided support between Chamisa and Nangagwa. To summarize, Nelson Chamisa's plans for Zimbabwe encompass job creation, energy sufficiency, and economic stability. His approach is inclusive, with a focus on both urban and rural communities. Despite the challenges he faces, Chamisa remains steadfast in his pursuit of the presidency, promising a new era of growth and development for Zimbabwe. As we conclude, remember that the road to change is often fraught with obstacles. Yet it is the will to overcome these challenges that can truly shape a nation's future. Will Chamisa succeed in his mission? Only time will tell. For now, Zimbabwe watches and waits, hoping for a brighter tomorrow.